My name is Camry Ivory, and I'm an audiovisual artist and musician. I use technology to explore the relationship between color, form, and sound. Back in 2015, I developed a device called Coloratura that allows me to use paintbrushes to create and manipulate electronic music. Using this device, I compose visual soundscapes that create art and music simultaneously in real time. This Coloratura device is composed of 12 paintbrushes that are wired to a circuit board that communicates with my computer. Each brush is assigned to a different color and plays a different note in the musical scale when it's touched to a conductive canvas. The brushes communicate with music production software on my computer, which allows me to use lots of effects like loopers and arpeggiators to create beautiful, lush layers of sound. Every painting that you see here was created with this Coloratura interface. My paintings are always displayed with a QR code that redirects to a video of the painting's creation so that observers can scan the code to see and hear each painting. Before I created Coloratura, my primary creative expression was through music. I was a singer-songwriter and I played piano and I sang backup vocals in several bands in Kansas City. I didn't really consider myself an artist at all, but I became more increasingly interested in adding more visual elements into some of my performances through lights and projections and costumes and choreography or working with other artists to do some collaborations. Eventually, I just got to a point where I wanted to remove the gap between the visual arts and the performing arts world entirely, and that was the impetus for creating Coloratura. Most of the visual soundscapes that I create are improvised. I may start each one with maybe a rough idea of the musical key I want to play in or maybe a rough sketch of the image I want to create, but I usually just let each piece evolve organically. And that's because every time I paint a brush stroke, I'm not just painting a color, I'm also painting a note. I have both a musical and visual output. So when I paint the next brush stroke, I have to choose in that moment, which of those inputs, the audio or the visual, I will respond to. Will I focus on the color of the paint on the brush or the note that the brush plays? Will I tolerate clashing colors to create musical harmony or will I tolerate dissonant notes to create visual harmony? Every brush stroke is a choice, and I often vacillate between the two choices, often within the same piece. By nature, as a musician, uh, my default choice is to focus on the musical composition over the visual composition. But when I get out of my way, when I divorce myself from the traditional notions of music theory, and I just let myself be led by the visual elements and I focus on the aesthetics over the auditory, I'm rewarded with these really beautiful, unique, almost otherworldly musical iterations and chord progressions that I may not have ever discovered otherwise. Like I said, it's a journey. It's a really amazing, exciting journey. Every piece takes me in a completely different direction and it really requires me to be vulnerable and humble. My work with Coloratura has completely changed the way that I interact with art and music and I hope that by viewing these pieces and learning more about my artistic practice, your perspective will be changed as well.